is going on guys welcome back for another episode of iron throne 2019 on the swill entertainment gaming channel all right so today we're going to discuss if iron throne is even worth playing in the year 2019 i have no idea if it is or not i have not played this game literally like maybe five months or so roughly five six months something like that now i played this game when it was in beta and then i played this game when it was over as of only available in like some european countries um and also, I think it was available in Australia, places like that, and it had a different name. I think, like, Firstborn Kingdom Come or something like that is what it used to be called. And then when it came over to the western side, the United States, they changed the name to Iron Throne. So everybody treated it like it was a brand new game, which it was not. I was already, like, VIP 9 at that point when it came out to the United States. And people were like, wow, how did you how did you um, get VIP 9 already? Did you spend? Not a dime. I don't think I've ever bought a dime in this game. I don't think so. All right, so what we need to do, now since we have not played in so long, of course our base has been attacked. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and make up some more troops and everything like that and heal up some troops if we can. I don't know. Now we don't have enough of anything to, um, we don't have enough of anything to do jack. All right, so what we need to do is get some grub. So let's go ahead and do our all. And that's a good feature. Now this game came out, this is supposed to kill like, King of Avalon, and yeah, it's supposed to do that. It's supposed to kill that game. Did it do it? Nope. Now, a lot of people do play this game. Let's go ahead and get our free stuff here. It has a lot of elements that are actually really good in games, guys. So if you guys are looking for a game, this is one of those ones that you want to try out. Now, when I put this in the rotation back on the, uh, the channel, I have no idea because this game is kind of shady to me. Like, if I could probably go to a different server, then yeah, it'll be okay. But being on the same on the same server that I'm on right now, not so much. All right, so because what happens is you have your own people trying to attack you, which kind of sucks. It's kind of like pointless. All right, so we need to do a lot of healing. So actually, where my where my healing my um oh here we go. We need to get our troops back. So let's go ahead and heal if we have enough. I don't think we do. Four hours, golly, and that's not even enough to do anything. Now, I think we have enough speed up to do whatever we have to do, I think. I don't know. So we need some more food, man. Farms, upgrade these jokers. And we don't have any more resources. Like, we have enough to here to do here, but I don't know, man. Like like I said, this game does have a lot of resource or elements in it that I, I love. And I wish other games would incorporate it, but, you know, whatever. Is it enough for me to switch to another game? I don't know yet. I would have to go back in. And I don't see anything brand new in the game. It looks the same. Like, I don't see, I haven't seen anything different. All right, so different researches we can do. We can do battle, production city, march speed, dimensional battle, uh, craft, troop training, dragon, hero training, troop training two. Okay, so that's a lot. That's a lot to swallow, guys. All right, I like basic equipment guy, uh, grade, crafting cost reduction. And we need to probably go more towards a... Uh, Damn, we just don't have the resources, man. We don't have the resources. But we can get it, though. It's not even an issue of getting it. Academy 10. Everything is pretty much Academy 10. Whether, whether it's get the Academy, infantry attack, we don't really need that. So pretty much we're going to have to go to production. Because right now we're, we're sucking on resources, guys. Horribly. What production? We need some more food production. So we need Academy 12 for that. So we're going to go with the... Uh, just to get some research done, we're going to go with this uh, wood. So that's two hours there. Okay, so we may have to, you know, incorporate ourselves and see what's going on. Let me check out the mail. Notice. Let's see. It says two things of mail, but we have a lot. Let's see. Maintenance rewards. Maintenance has been completed. And this was back in September 2018. So wait, September, October. Yeah, six months. I haven't played this game in six months. Woo! I have not logged in. I haven't done jack. All right, major update celebration gift. Uh, prepare seven-day login rewards to celebrate major updates. Log in every day to receive rewards during the event period. <clears throat> so that's good. They want us to log in. I could do that. Power of streamer. Prediction missed the mark. Nevertheless, prepared small gift to complete the old year. Happy New Year. Okay. 
So we're kind of like catching up to the New Year's now. And then we got the Blood Moon is Rising. All right, so Blood Moon is Rising. When the Blood Moon turns to crimson color, the battle with opponent cannons will begin. Travel to the Blood Moon by using the Blood Moon teleport item after <clears throat> the war starts. Only lords with citadels above 18 or higher may enter. If you do not have enough Blood Moon participation, you may enter uh, using gold. Win the Blood Moon War by joining forces with the other lords of the same kingdoms. All right, so we got us a Blood Moon teleport. Got that. Um, castle protection notice. All right, so this, uh, welcome your return, my lord. I can your castle in safe, <clears throat> safety while you're away. It's time to unlatch the castle gates to announce that the world that the, that's in the firstborn has returned. Hey, I'm back. I guess we're bad guys. I don't know. Uh, your castle exposed to enemy while you were not ready. 20,000 defense troops were drafted. And 24-hour peace shield has acquired to defend your castle. Triggered uh, once a day when you lose all of your troops. Wow. So if you lose all of your troops, you get a peace shield. That I like. They, they take care of you that way. They really take care of you. Now, what do I need to go to VIP 11? Let's see if we can earn some points. We can use this one. We got four. Because we need to get VIP 11, man. We've been VIP 10 since, like, forever, man. Because I used to play this game every day when it was in... <clears throat> when it was in beta. Well, not, well, not this one. I don't know if we had to start over. I can't remember. I don't, think, I don't know if we have enough to make troops. We should. We do. 28 minutes. And we need to get these guys upgraded because... We need farm 15, training grounds 15... Archery range. Okay, so we're not going to get anything. Like a higher tier troop, we're not going to get those. However, I don't know, guys. This is an easier game to play. Like, as far as getting resources, it is a little bit easier. I won't lie. So we're on a tier threes, but we don't have enough resources for those guys. So let's go ahead and get some resources here. Let's use these stones. You don't have the stones. All right, let's go back and craft these guys right here. Those tier threes. Oh, I forgot we can turn our stuff around, too. Hey, guys, this was what made me love this game when I first started playing. Yes. All right, so if you guys, this is your first time joining the Swill Entertainment Gaming Channel, and you like this game and you want to see some more of it, guys, make sure you guys subscribe, and also make sure that that bell notification is turned on so that you will know every time we post a video on the channel. You don't want to be first? I mean, if you want to be first, you want to make sure you're not last. All right, so let's see. And also put in the comments below, guys, that you want to put this in a rotation. If you guys want to see this game in a rotation, because we are looking to, you know, cut some games out, put some games in, or whatever the case is, guys, because there's, like, we're trying to get some different things on the channel, guys, because it's, like, getting kind of stale. I ain't going to lie. I think it's getting stale. But I love every one of your comments. I do respond to them all as much as I possibly can. I know people ask for different videos to do this and do that, which is really great. You know, we try to accommodate as much as we can. All right, so we got the merchant here. Free, Yeah, this is good. And the dimensional battle is pretty good, too, where you have to click on your wall, and then you go to... Actually, let me repair my traps if you can. Nope. I don't have anything to repair. I got to make some fresh ones, I guess. Wall durability. <clears throat> it's durable. So that's good. Now, we can go to the dimensional battle here. I think this is at town mode. We can always go to that. Um, wait. It says hero... Hey, this hero Lauren. Rand set. Eldred set. Wi-Fi connection is recommended. I don't care about Wi-Fi. It's going to download at least. But that's fine. That is fine and dandy. I don't mind. I don't mind. Now, there's a bunch of different things in here as well. Makes me say, hmm, troop evacuation. So, evacuated troops are shielded from all damage from battle. Let's go ahead. And, well, we don't need to evacuate them. We don't need to spend any, any coins or anything like that. Because we have a big old power shield here, guys. Power shield. All right, so we are next to DKZ. And this guy is probably the one that was probably attacking me. I don't know. Maybe. Bro Gamer. This guy is 17. We're 15. I didn't realize we're 15. We made it that far. Hold on a second here, guys. Swill Entertainment. Hey. Regret. Graduated MML. VIP Quest. You know what, guys? I think this game is going to come back because I missed this one a lot. VIP Quest. Let's go do this. Attack monsters, gather resources, upgrade building. We don't even have any um 
any troops right now. We can use speed ups though, but we're gonna go ahead and wait this one out. We're gonna wait it out. Challenges. Let's claim these things up. Upgrade forge to 15. So we need to pretty much get everything to 15. That way we can go to 16. And we're gonna go ahead and join an alliance as well. I don't know which one to join, who's cool, which whatever the case is, who knows? I don't know. So I just know we don't have any anything that we can do on that one, guys. I don't know. I just want to better take this dude right here, bro gamer. I'm sure he has higher level troops, but I don't know. Let's see if we do have any kind of troops at all. I don't think we have anything. Let's deploy this guy here. Roderick. Let's see if we can actually win a battle here. Killing some stuffs. I don't really know. Yeah! I think I'll come back, guys. I think so. Don't call it a comeback. But yeah, we killed a little... And we can, we can deploy, I think, like, maybe six marches, I think. I don't remember how many we can march out. We can deploy uh, several amounts. So what we probably need to do... And it's kind of hard to tell when a kill event is because this is... It's always a kill event in this game. So we got 1.3 million food. And, yeah, we need some more everything else. So what we're going to more than likely do... We're going to go ahead and farm... Ghost Tug. You guys are probably going to attack me a little bit. That's all good. We're going to go ahead and farm a bit. Just farm. I don't mind. If you guys don't mind, I don't either. Let's go. Actually, we don't need wood. We need to go ahead and search. Let's see the search. Yeah. We need quarry stuff. Let's go there. Level four. Click on it. Yeah, that's how you do it. We'll get this guy going. I don't know who to deploy. Let's deploy him. And we need some of this little, is this marble? Or whatever this is. Iron. Let's go search. Quarry. Now oh, we already got that one. Let's get the iron mine. Let's go to the iron mine there. Let's go search. Got some resources. Deploy. We must select troops first. Oh, we don't have any more. Oh. That's fine. All right, so we don't have any troops. I guess we got to have troops to do some stuff, guys. I guess. I guess. But at least we did kill the monsters, though. At least. That's pretty cool. I'm happy about that. All right. But yeah, I missed this game. So we're going to go ahead and look for an alliance at some other point. But we're going to go ahead and wrap this episode up. And I hope that did answer the question, is this game worthy of us playing it in 2019? I'm going to say yes. Rapid repair package, nine or 10 bucks. Peace shield, seven days. Wow, I can have a peace shield for seven days? I'd rather attack people, though. That's what I usually do. Get my resources, man. But it's all good, though. We're not going to buy that one. But I haven't spent, I don't think I spent a dime in this game yet. I don't think I did. But either way, guys, like I said, hopefully it does determine if this game is worthy of, you know, 2019 playership. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. But hopefully it does. And hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you guys did, drop a like on the video. Hopefully you did enjoy it. If you didn't like it, you can drop a dislike as well. But at least put in the comments as to what you did not like about the video. And if you did like it, put in the comments why you did like it. And if you guys want it in a rotation, put that, you know, you want it in a rotation. If you don't want it in a rotation, also put that in that you don't want it as a, in a rotation as well. Because it does help me determining which games I would like to put in a rotation. And I kind of want to do what I really want to do. I'm still going to keep on making games like as far as when they first come out. First impressions and stuff like that. We'll do that. But as far as like constantly making different rotation games and all that. Because we, we do like a lot of games in rotation. That's confusing. Uh, we want to kind of cut back on that. Because it is kind of, like I said, it is kind of confusing. But I don't mind doing it. Because I play games all day long, guys. Whether I'm at work, I'm at home, on the weekend. It doesn't matter. I'm playing video games, period. Because I couldn't play them when I was a kid. So now I'm an adult. I can do it all I want. Nobody can tell me anything otherwise. But either way, either way guys, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you good people on the next episode. Peace out. Love you all.